Okay, let's take differentiation a little bit further now. So essentially the reason why we differentiate a curve is to find its gradient. So if a question is asking for the gradient of a curve, we need to know immediately we're going to have to differentiate. So y equals this, dy dx equals, now remember our rules, bring the power down in front, minus 1 from the power. So doing that to this is going to create 6x squared plus 10x minus 7. If you're unsure about how any of that works, go and check out one of my previous videos on the basic rules of differentiating. Right, so now we're here. That means this equation is the equation for the gradient at any point on the curve. So we can find the gradient of this curve at any point by plugging in any value into the x. So in the question, we want to know what the gradient is when x equals 2. So we plug in x equals 2. If you want to know the gradient when x equals 5, we plug in 5. If the gradient when x is minus 7, we plug in minus 7. So here, when x equals 2, we've got 6, 2 squared plus 10, 2 minus 7. I always like to substitute in, in brackets. It's so important um, because it makes it very, very clear. It reduces the chance for making a mistake. So using bid mass, we always do indices before the multiplication. So 2 squared is 4. 4 times 6 is 24. 10 times 2 is 20. And minus 7. 24 plus 20 is 44. Minus 7 is 37. And that's it. That's the gradient of this curve when x equals 2.